For our tall kneeling wall ball dynamic chest press, or chest toss, chest pass, whatever you want to call it, we're going to be in our tall kneeling position, ball right at your chest. So this is going to be our starting position. From there we're going to do a hip hinge, so think about butt to the wall behind you. Like we're kind of loading up the back of our hips here. From there you're going to snap the hips forward, throwing the ball as hard as you can into the wall. Catch it at your chest and that's where you finish. Then we're going to go butt to the wall behind you, snap forward, throw it into the wall. So you should be feeling this a lot more in your glutes, a little bit in your core, and your chest and arm muscles as you explode and throw it. So what's going on here, as you go backwards with your hips, you're loading up your glutes, and then you're snapping forward, and you're using that snapping momentum to help you throw the ball a little bit faster, a little bit harder into the wall. So you're using that hip snap to catapult the ball. So the biggest thing that we're gonna see go wrong here is we want it to be one fluid motion, hip snap, chest pass, but instead what usually goes wrong is we go hips back, stand up, throw it. Hips back, stand up, throw it. Where it's two separate movements, we don't want that. It should be one fluid motion in and out. 